Hi everyone, it's Elizabeth K. Spear with your VW Now. Today we're here talking with... Edward Covina from with the Arts and Cultural Center. Welcome. How are you? Great, I like Elizabeth. your tie. Thank you. It's 1980s. 1980s, well, you know how 80s is going now in fashion. Um, anyway, back to the task at hand. What services do you provide at the Arts and Cultural Center? Well, by definition, Arts and Culture, the right there it tells you we do exhibitions, we do trips to museums, we provide arts pro programming for kids, for parents, for students. We do quilting. We have a large, large store with probably the largest selection of fabrics for any MWR facility in Europe, amongst many things. Great. So what if, what if you're not an artist, though? What if your definition of being crafty is very, very limited? We operate by the belief that everybody's an artist. So, you know, it's all up to how we handshake that activity with each of the members that come into the uh, facility. Right. Uh, an example, I'll be quick, is, you know, um, I have some friends, uh, Jason and Cheryl Mansill. Both of them didn't know how to frame. They work with Denise in the frame shop. They produce masterpieces there for years. Then he decided that he wanted to give her a birthday gift, and he created a masterpiece quilt, which, by the way, guys, I'm going to feature in the newsletter for May. Great. So, the frame shop, you can also get things custom built, or do people do it themselves? Primarily, it's geared for the do-it-yourselfers, but, you know, Denise is a, a formidable artist, and she's a custom framer, too, so you get the benefits of both, because if you take the class, you get six free hours, you have Denise, who has 30 years' experience, and wow. you can produce masterpieces just like Jason and Cheryl did, and they knew nothing about it to start with. That's great, because I know as a former soldier, we have tons of stuff that we get from our units, coin racks, certificates, whatever, commissioning certificates, what have you, and that'd be really great to kind of frame it, make it a little bit more special instead of just throwing it in a Rubbermaid box. Well, everybody's special, so we do the messy tops, you know, for moms and tots and their fathers too, and they get down dirty on the floor, and they finger paint, and they create masterpieces together as a family. Mm -hmm. We celebrate kids because each one of them is a genius, so they have, we have classes in fine art, ceramics, uh, even sewing classes for kids. And like I said at the Art Expo recently back in December 2010, mm -hmm. you don't know whether you have a Michelangelo or Leonardo within your family. You so we know. put our arms around them and we support them completely. I think every parent likes to think they have their own Michelangelo in the making, right? I just think that bit. if you just visit one of the exhibitions that we have for kids, whether it be the Art Expo or the recent Earth Week Echo Effect, art exhibition, you will find that they are a top-of-the-line artists. I would compare them to any of the famous ones. In fact, probably better. So, <laughs> you know, I think this community really pump, pumps out some really good work, and we are there to support them, you know? You ha I've been asked the question, you know, what is the importance of the Arts and Cultural Center and what we do and what we offer? Well, you know, we have soldiers that are deployed, okay? Mm -hmm. They are undergoing stress. They're very busy serving our country. So are the families, by the way, you know? So yeah. the kids, you know, the kids, they need, they need activities. Sure. The soldiers, too. By the way, Cheryl is a soldier, you know, and Jason supports her completely. Um, you know, they got together and they produced a, mas a masterful quilt. You know, kids need the same release also. I'm That's thinking true. of providing martial arts, possibly dance classes. I've got a lot of ideas for programming, and it's That's mostly great. for, you know, entertainment, stress release, you know, and just simply being artsy. Like you said, who's an artist? Everybody is. Sure, absolutely. I bet some parents will be relieved to not have coloring on the wall. <laughs> they can actually bring their kids someplace where they can do that. Well, we have one more surprise for the community, which is that we have a room that I call the multi-purpose room. I have mm -hmm. mats on the floor, and we do ceramic birthday parties there. The kids right. have mirrors to look at themselves, and they roll around on the mats, and the parents actually get to celebrate the birthdays. Their, their walls aren't being broken down. <laughs> the rugs don't have, you know, juice on the floor. That's and great. the kids are letting out all the tension and having oh, fun. Yeah. So, you know, it's very popular. We get a lot of support for the ceramic activity, so I think it's a win-win for everybody. That's great. <laughs> yeah. So, um, what other activities do you have for well, people real to get quickly, into? Real quickly, I would say to you that if you really want to know what we do, look at the MWR online or BW right. Now in our newsletter. You'll find our calendar on the shopping center, mm -hmm. on the website. Come into the store, pick up a calendar, and decide what classes and what kind of arts creative involvement you want. We're here. We have people coming all the way from Grafenberg. Wow. We have people coming from Aviano, Italy. 
and they come because we're one of the top stores in Europe, you know. And sometimes it surprises me when somebody comes in and doesn't know who we are. So, you know, you guys here do a great job of supporting us. Um, I'm glad to be here talking to you, Elizabeth, and I'm glad you called me today and, uh, and that we changed the schedule the way that we did. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> yeah. So your store, what does it include? For those who want to come out. We from, have fine way. arts, we have scrapbooking, we have um, a large selection of fabrics, we have threads, yarn, nearly everything that you want. That's great. Well, everybody, thank you so much for tuning in today. For more information, please. I want to thank everybody. Uh, please come to the Arts and Cultural Center. Uh, our number is 388-9421. That's DSN and civilian. 0621-338-9421. Come to the exhibitions, come and have fun, and let's paint everybody. All right. Thanks very much, everybody. Stay classy, Heidelberg. Boom! You got it. <laughs>